Hello, hello, good evening. Can you hear me? Good evening. Hi. Hi. How are you? Fine, good sir. Great, good. good sir. Hi, good evening, good evening. Welcome. Welcome to our class. Welcome to our English class. Well, let's start. Let's start. What day is today? Tuesday. 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 Hello. Five, seven, twenty, twenty. <laughs> yes, today is Tuesday, July, July 5th, actually, right? Okay, July 5th of 2022. Correct. Well, not many people today in the class because of the, of the rain, I suppose. Yes, many people have inconveniences, difficulties, and it's understandable. Yes, because there's so much rain. And it's been raining so, so much. Well, some people are writing um, on the chat. Let me check what they say. Hmm, it's not in our group, actually. It's in the features group. Okay. Well, welcome. Let's see, right on the chat. How do you feel today? Mm -hmm. I feel... Tired, I feel sleepy, I feel gray, I feel fine, I feel okay, I don't know, I feel good, I feel, good. I feel very stressed, oh my god, <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Mm -hmm. En camino Brenda, on her way home, yes, I feel good, that's awesome. Great. Nice. Excellent. All right. Some people are still connecting, which is good, which is great. Hopefully. All right. Not much rain. Okay. From one to five, how much rain do you have in the place where you live? How much rain? From one to five. Five is a lot of rain. Four somehow three so so two not much and one very little rain i would say uh -huh, three four three four yes there's a lot of rain okay yes four so it's raining a lot where you live hopefully it's not affecting the families the houses, the streets, the connections, right? Hopefully. Let's cross our fingers. <laughs> yes, and let's pray that we don't get so much affected, all right? I feel good and it's raining three. So from one to five, three, yeah, it's more than half. It's raining a lot, all right? Great. All right, now, what do you remember from the class yesterday? If you were in class or if you saw the video, if you completed the assignments, all right? Today is the last class of the unit three. Tomorrow we start the class of the unit four, actually. Today is the last class of the unit three. Tomorrow we start the first class of the unit four and it's gonna be the last session that you have to complete on the platform. So what do you remember? Anything that you remember from the class yesterday or something that you watch on the video? Uh -huh. Preposition in on at. Exactly, prepositions of time in on at. All right, remember any sentence, any expression, any phrase, Cualquier oración que recuerden, escriban en el chat. Usando prepositions of time, of course. Mm -hmm. All right. 
My goodness. All right, some other people say they are going home. I think it's still Brenda. Oh, Briseida. Okay. Briseida is going home. Mm -hmm. What else do you remember? Okay, in June, what time is it? All right, perfect. Mm -hmm. On Saturday, that's nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, at noon, at 12, that's great. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Nice. All right, so we're waiting for, yes, Brenda, Preseida, and Douglas to connect. They already reported. All right, Odalis, welcome. Alexandra, welcome. Brenda, hi, you are here already. Uh -huh. Mario takes a break at 3 p.m. That's awesome. What time? Activities. Mm -hmm. Activity. Hey, good evening. Activities names, yes. True, 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 true. All right, what else, what else? What else we studying? Let's remember. Okay. So some people are getting connected already, which is great. And we're gonna have the attendance in some minutes so that we can, yes, know who is participating in today's class, of course. Uh-huh, what else? What else do you remember using on, at, in, in, on, at? <laughs> remember I told you that that is the logical order for me to practice. It would be easier if you remember those prepositions with those days. I mean, with those um, orders, days, month, years, times, exactly. All right, here we go. Okay, let's see, who else has connected tonight? So we got uh, Cesar, Ernesto Batres, Yvonne, Brenda, Mario, Juan Cristobal Odalis, Ramon, and Alessandra so far. Oh, workshops at noon, yeah, at, at try. All right, <laughs> let's have the attendance before anything else happens. Andrea? Hello, not here. <laughs> okay, Brenda, she's going home. Viseida, not yet. Hasn't arrived yet. She said she's going home too. All right, hopefully she let us know when she, when she gets in. Carlos Daniel, not here. Cesar. Present teacher. Hi, Douglas. Arriving home still. Ernesto Batres. I saw Mr. Teacher. Batres. Hi, welcome. Esmeralda. Esme. I think I saw Esmeralda probably. I'm wrong. Yes, not here yet. Mm -hmm. uh, Stella, not here. Yvonne, still going home. Hi, <laughs> still driving. Uh, repeat, please. Driving. Uh, no. Home. Uh, yeah. All right, arriving home. Nice. Yes. Okay, perfect. All right, Juan Cristobal. Present, teacher. Hello. Alessandra. Going home, probably. Present. Hi. Present. <laughs> Hi. All right. Mario Ernesto. Present. Hi. Mayra Lizeth. Not here. Odalis. Present. Hi, Odalis. Listening again. 
Yes. Okay, Ramon. Yes. Present teacher. All right. <laughs> Welcome. And Jennifer. In trouble, Jennifer. She's not connecting. I don't know what happened to Jennifer. Oh, Brenda says present with a happy face. Andrea says present with <coughs> with the chat. All right. Hi, Andrea. Let's see. Hi, teacher. How are you? I am fine, teacher. And you? I'm fine, thank you. All right, I thought you were having some problems because you hadn't connected last classes. Uh, uh, yeah. Yesterday, yes. I'm sick. I was sick. Were you sick? Uh, no, no, I feel like it's like como soy en San Sonate, casi no me agarraba en las redes. Mm, no signal, no connection. Ajá, okay. entonces sí, ayer no, no me conecté, pero hoy sí. Thank Estoy you. Lista. All right, perfect. Thank you for letting Gracias. us know. All right. So here we go. As we were mentioning, this is going to be the class number... 15, our video conference number 15. Oof. One more week and it finishes. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> it's one more unit actually, and that's it. All right, so today is Tuesday, July 5th of 2022. Okay, so at the end of this session, Participants will be able to practice vocabulary that we have studied throughout the unit three. Okay. And to start with, we're going to have a review, a puzzle, review how to apply the auxiliary do or does when you ask for questions. Okay. Remember, the auxiliary do or does help us to ask questions. Of course, you can now ask. It's impossible in English to ask questions without an auxiliary, mainly in simple present, right? So no matters if the question is yes, no question, you need an auxiliary. If the question is information question, you need an auxiliary. So you always need an auxiliary, right? So you say, do you like coffee? Yes, I do. Or no, I don't. Okay, do you live in Santa Ana? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Do you have a pet? Yes, I do. No, I don't. So imagine you are talking about your husband, your wife, and then you say, oh, does she drive to work? Yes, she does. Or no, she doesn't. Yes. Or does he live near the work or near work? Yes, he does. No, he doesn't, right? So we always need an auxiliary to ask a question. So to start, we're going to create best questions and you're going to practice with your partner the questions. For example, the first one would be do or does, number one. Do. do. Mm -hmm. And you ask your partner, do you like coffee or tea? And your partner probably say, oh, I like coffee or I prefer tea. I sometimes drink coffee or I sometimes drink tea, whatever the answer is, right? So this is what we're going to do. I'm going to share this with you. I'm going to make you work in some groups. Let me see. We're going to make you know, maybe groups of three people, two or three people. And I send the image, all right, so that you can create the questions. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, Andrea. Le estoy proyectando mi pantalla. 
vamos, vamos rellenando aquí en eh, el cuadrito y vamos a ¿ok? Ok. Ok. Entonces, de hecho, la resolvió. Sería, do, like, do you like coffee or tea? Yes. Do it. Do okay. Yes, do. I like coffee. Thank you. Uh, I like coffee too. I don't like tea. I don't like tea. Uh -huh. I prefer the, the coffee. Yes. The second uh, sentence. When... ¿Cómo se dice? Ah, me, me too, ¿verdad? Me too, ¿verdad? Está ya se puede ver. Sí. Modales. Sí. Pero tengo mala conexión por ratitos pierdo lo del Laura no escucho. Ah, sí, se escucha. Y aquí solo de práctica. Colocarla. Sí. El el ver tu tu do el do o el dos das number one do it okay okay ah Douglas se está conectado con nosotros también ah pues él se unió quizás pues no sé la cosa es que ya estamos aquí. Ah, vale, ok. Iniciamos a la primera, entonces. Ok. La primera, I do. do you like coffee or tea? Or tea sería. Do. Oh, tea or tea, exacto. Do you like coffee or tea? Ok. Ok. Teacher. Ya me lo voy a preguntar. Teacher. <coughs> Hello. Vaya, en el caso de la segunda, uh -huh. como el auxiliar lo tiene el working, uh -huh. tendría que ser do, ¿verdad? Mm. No, ¿verdad? Dos. Yeah. When I. Tienen que, tienen que explicar el subject. Y el subject en este caso sería I. When do, do I, I start working. Uh -huh. Es como que usted aplica un trabajo y pregunta, ¿cuándo empiezo a trabajar? Mm -hmm. no. okay. All right. Welcome. Vaya, don <laughs> I start working work before, uh, at eight o'clock. Eight. Eight. Okay. Eight o'clock. Eight o'clock. Okay, vamos con la tres. Why? Why does she always, she always come late? Come late. Okay. Why does she always come late? Ahí late. sería do, me imagino, porque es she. Estamos hablando de she. Cuando es why, why do she, why does she. Pero que no está hablando de ella, de la tercera, tercera persona. persona. Tercera persona. Uh -huh. Y en cambio en la you, estamos hablando de primera persona. En la sexta. What do you? What do you think? Uh -huh. Number seven. How, do... How does I think singing? 
Das. No do. How do. Ay. Así no me queda bien clara a mí ni la otra, la, la segunda. Porque empieza con I sign in. La otra es I start working. When do I see? Está hablando de primera persona. De mí. Por eso tiene que ser do. Uh -huh. Do. When do I start working? How do you feel? Who does she work? Who does she work with? Okay, Douglas. That's why it's come late. Okay. What do you think? How do I sing in? Douglas. Uh, no, it was that. Perdón. I want to talk. No, ya lo dijo. Yo dije, eh, why she always come late? Sí, y después, ahí... yo dije, what do you think? Después dijo Ajá. Brenda, el how I sing in. No la escuché, perdón. Where sí. do you sing in? What does she like the real? Y where do you we keep? No, where do we keep the sharp? Sharpener, algo así, ¿verdad? Teacher, ¿cómo Teacher, se dice esa palabra, por favor? Sharpener, ¿esa? Sharpener, yes. Sharpener. Ah, oh, ok. Ah, pues sería. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Where do Thank. we keep the sharpener? Ok. Ok. Hoy sigue usted. Creo que hoy está muy okay. <coughs> Pero como que estamos preguntando ella. Ajá, es como que yo, les, yo te estoy preguntando a ti. Eh, where do you sing? En esa, ah, sí, en esa. Where do? Ajá. Aquí, what do she like to read? What? Ahí no sería does, that. Porque aquí estamos preguntando si a ella. ¿Te gusta el qué? Tu red. Lee. Alejandra le gusta leer a ella en tercera persona. Como que es una plática entre los dos. Entonces sería, what does she like the red? Sí. Ajá, exacto. ¿Qué es sin? ¿Cómo registrarte? Así como sin session, que es como iniciar sesión. <ríe> o cómo me registro. ¿Cómo, te, cómo me registro? Yes, the pronunciation sign, sign in. Sign. Sign in, yes. Sign in session, yes. Uh, with the... With the... Mm, the class code. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, that's possible. How do I sign in? Yes. Como dijo. <laughs> How do I sign in? 
en César says with the class code. ¿Cómo me registro? Ah, con su código, le dicen. Podría ser. Con su password. <laughs> class code o password, vea. Yes, with... it depends. If you receive a code, it's a code. If you receive a... if you create a password, it's with a password. O sea, ambas es también, vea. Yes. I sync with the class, class, uh, class code. Yeah, I sign in with the class code. I sign, sign in. Yes. With the class code. Mm -hmm. Y de ahí de pregunta, where do you sign in? Sign in. Mm -hmm. You do it. Donde? Mm-hmm. Where? Uh -huh. Donde me registro? Sería <laughs> do, 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 das, das, do, 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 das. <laughs> no sé cómo me queda. Do, das, do, das, das, do, 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 das, do. Ahí así me queda, ¿no? Las primeras tres. The first one, this says, do you like coffee or tea? I do. Uh -huh. The second one, when does I start working? Ahí tengo Pero ahí no estamos hablando, uh -huh. ahí no estamos hablando en primera persona, no sería do. Uh -huh. When I do, when do I start working? When does I start working? Okay. No, licencia no va a sacar de dudas después. Pues. La tercera sí, how do you feel? The number four, who does she work mm -hmm. with? No. Cantare. Sin. ¿Es firma o canto? Canto. No, sign in es firmar o registrar. Ah, es, okay. es, es, es la N antes. Y... Es sync. Ajá, es que sync es la N antes. Yes, sign in, registrarse. Sign Ingresar in. a una cuenta. Mm -hmm. Sign in your email ¿Cómo address. ingresar? Mm -hmm. O no, a un website. Su account. Mm -hmm. mm, okay. Yes. Thank you, teacher. All right. How Yes. With sign in credentials. Yes. Hola, podemos poner un poquito más. Your password. You can, can, you can sign in with your credential, yes. with your password. Yes, that's correct. With your credential. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. you can change with your credential. Right. Okay. Next, number eight. Andrea Pinay, the data. Help me, please. <laughs> Sí, igual a mí, por eso creo yo, a mí me gusta ir, ir escribiendo cuando escucho algo, o sea, para ir ayudando al vocabulario. Sí, no es broma, hay cosas que a mí, si yo no las escribo, no se me quedan. <risa>
All right. Number one. Uh -huh. Okay. So the question is? Coffee. Do you like coffee? Do you coffee? like Do you like coffee or tea? tea. Uh -huh. And the answer? When do, when do I <laughs> start working? All right. When do I start working? That's a question number two. But for example, if you receive the question number one, do you like coffee or tea? What do you say? What is your answer? Yes, oh. I do. Yes. I do. Do you like coffee or tea? Yes, I do. Or I like coffee. Or I like I tea. Like coffee. I, I like, like coffee, coffee right? tea. <laughs> or I like tea. Well, I like coffee. Uh -huh. So imagine that you go to a job interview and that you apply for a new job. And then you say, I mean, you receive the acceptance, right? They, they, they let you know you are accepted to this work. You are accepted, you're given this job. And they say, oh, when do I start working? So you can say that, right? Or in the morning, when do I start working? I start working at seven, at six, at eight. <clears throat> All right, number three. Okay. How do you feel? How do you feel? And today I ask you at the beginning of the class, how do you feel? I feel very stressed some people say. <laughs> I feel happy, I feel okay, I feel fine, right? So you can answer that, right? Number four. <laughs> no. sleepy. sleepy, tired, I feel, disappointed, I feel crazy, crazy, wild, <laughs> all right, sick, all right. Dice, en este caso, en este caso, la expresión me siento sería I feel me o solo I feel. I feel. Yes. I feel good. If you want to say I am feeling, that's okay. But usually people say I feel or I'm okay. feeling. I'm feeling, yeah, feel. it's accepted as well. I yes. feel good. I, I feel good. good. Exactly. <laughs> the song. Na, 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 na. Then you start dancing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Number four. What does she Who work? Does? Who does she work? Who does? Who does she work with? Uh -huh. She works with her colleagues, her family. She works with uh, foreigners or Americans, right? She works with people from Europe, from other countries, right? Why? Does. Mm -hmm. She always come late. Why does she always come late? <laughs> she has issues with the traffic. She gets stuck in traffic. She comes from far away. She misses the bus, right? Number six. She can play forever because she was far away. <laughs> exactly. That's a possibility. All right. Number six. What do you think? Exactly. You this think? is a very common question <laughs> that you ask people. What do you think? It's when you want to know the opinion of the other person. Yes. For example, if you finish something and you want to know the opinion of the other person say, oh look what do you think right okay number seven who do how do i mm -hmm. sign how how do i sign in you sign in with your password with your credentials with your class code yes how how do i sign in and where do you think in? Yes, where do you sign in? Yes, you sign in this account, you sign in on this uh, toolbar, you sign in on this chart or whatever. All right, number nine. What does she like what to read? What does she like to read? Okay, she likes to read comedies, horror. She likes to read self-help book, economy books. She likes to read thrillers, oh, mysteries, novels, right? And the last one. Where do, where do 
Okay, where do we keep the sharpener? You know what a sharpener is? Yes? As a capuntas. <laughs> so imagine that you still use a pencil. So you say, well, where do we keep the sharpener? We keep the sharpener on the desk, on this cabinet, on this box, whatever. Right. Okay, no questions? No questions. All right, perfect. Excellent. Yes, I see there was a lot of work in between you. That's really nice. Let's see. Oh, it's just some practice. Oh, what time do you? What time do you? Wake up. What time do you wake up? What time do you? Eat breakfast. Eat breakfast. What time do you? Brush, 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 brush your teeth. teeth. What time do you? Go to school. Go to school, of course. Probably you don't go to school because you receive online classes. You can substitute the go to school for. Uh -huh. Go to work. Exactly. Go to work. <laughs> what, exactly. What time do you go to work? Uh huh. What time do you cook? What time cook. do you cook? cook? What time do you eat? It's supper. It's supper. Supper is another word for. I don't know. Don't know. No Diner. idea. Dinner. Exactly. Diner. Dinner. Dinner. <laughs> so, what time do you eat dinner? What time do you eat supper? It's the same. Yes. Remember yeah. the este cuadro famoso, la última cena. They usually in English call it the last supper. So oh. supper or dinner is the same, yes. Some people okay. say supper, some other people say dinner, of course. What time do watch you watch TV? TV? Uh -huh. What time do you? Go to sleep. sleep. Go to sleep, all right. Mm -hmm. And my suggestion is that probably you say at six, at four, at three, at noon, at midnight, but don't only answer with one single word in english it's recommended that when you practice try to practice with the complete idea for example if somebody in the class asks me what time do you eat supper well i explain right i give a complete idea uh usually eat supper or i usually eat dinner around 6 or 6 30. after i get home from work i sometimes cook i sometimes prepare my dinner so i usually eat dinner at 6 or 6 30. yes but you give a long sentence traten de dar como una explicacióncita no solamente digan at three at four at seven porque eso es, aunque está correcto debería de tratar de ser como un poquito más explicativo right so that you can construct your ideas de esa forma se van a acostumbrar a dar una respuesta un poco más sustentadas no tan así escuetas right but just one word Okay, so we're gonna practice with the same groups. Eso no necesitan escribir. Esto es un repaso, pero si ustedes quieren escribir, it's up to you. You are in the total right of doing it if you want to do it. But if you don't want to do it, you just want to practice speaking, it's okay. All right? Same groups? All right, here we go. Hola. Hola. ¿Me escuchan? ¿Sí? ¿Y a mí? Sí. Vaya. Mm -hmm.
Pero Ernesto, falta. ¿Verdad que como que vamos a dar una explicación de esas imágenes? Más casi no le, no le escucho, que estoy en un teléfono porque se me apagó la computadora. Ah, sí. Es como, ajá. Uh -huh. Sí, vamos a poner como la hora. Hello. Time, do you? Hola. Hola, hola. Eh, estamos claros lo que vamos a hacer. No sé si para practicar eh, responde uno Andrea, responde uno Briseida, responde uno yo. ¿Les parece? Sí, está bien. Ok, voy a empezar yo. La teacher dijo que hiciéramos una oración un poquito con una idea más, más larga. De la uh -huh. que ahora. Ah, correcto. Wake ah. up. What time do you wake up? Um, Número así, ¿verdad? Sin ningún número a la par, pero si ya decimos 7:13, eh, ahí sí sería AM. Ok. Vaya. Pregunto esto. What time to do you wake up? I wake up at uh, five o'clock. What time do you hit breakfast? Eat breakfast. Eat breakfast. Eat, uh -huh. eat breakfast. I eat breakfast at seven and a half or seven thirty. What time do you brush your teeth? I brush my teeth at um, seven sixty. And what time do you go to go to work? <laughs> That's good. <laughs> to work. I go to work at seven sixty five sixty. What time do you watch TV? Algo así, ponerle ponerle una actividad al a la respuesta, o sea, después de qué qué hago, pues, o sea, no solo quedarnos ahí en el, en la hora, en sí. Sería I go up at six. I am uh, before King is here. La de eat breakfast. La que se usa. Ah, vaya. Ah, I. Sí, bueno, sería parte de lo bueno. Dar gracias a, a Dios por el día. Arreglar la cama. Uh -huh. Shower. Um, ¿Cómo se dice? Agradezco. ¿Cómo se dice qué? Agradezco. Agradezco. A la vida. <risa> Agradecer. Eat breakfast. Uh, I breakfast at seven o'clock. What time do you brush your teeth? Um, there you go. Twenty. 7.25 I am si quiero decir 7.25 7.25 am what time do you go to work I go to work um, 7.13 I am 
7, a las 7 y 13. ¿O cómo es? ¿7 y media no es? Uh, 7, 30, 30, 30, 30. Porque 7, 13 son las 7 y 13. Ok, entonces sería, I go to work at 7.13, no sé, 7.30. I am. Es que 30, 30 se pronuncia como decir cerillo, fer, fer, con Z, 30. 30. 30, con Z, 30. O oh, Tori, algunos dicen Tori. Ok. Ah, ahí vamos a ir aprendiendo. <laughs> What time do you watch TV? I never watch TV. <laughs> oh. Casi no tengo tiempo. <laughs> ok. What time do you cook? I never, <laughs> no, I never say no. I never had to cook. What time do you eat supper? Eso sería como la cena, ¿no? Okay. I eat supper. 7 p.m. Okay. What time do you go to sleep? I go to sleep at 10.30 p.m. Okay. Bye. Hoy le pregunta Odalis a Alexandra. Alexandra. Okay. Yeah. For my next day. Uh -huh. I press it out. Uh, I cook on Sunday. At uh, Yeah. I took lobster in tomato tomato sauce. In tomato and tomato tomato sauce. Yeah, bye. Bye. De ahí quiero ver. Eat breakfast. Quiero ver. What time do you eat breakfast? Uh -huh. What time? Bueno, la compañera. Aquí le estamos poniendo. Eh, Podría ser así para no poner solo. ¿Cómo no? Sí. No, 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 no sé qué. I go to school in the morning with my sister. Podría ser una oración en la, poniendo tiempo de en la mañana con mi hermana. Pero es que hay que agregarle el horario. Night. Ah, el horario. At night. Y ponte de la noche viendo el aro. Baba. <risa> Un 
No, pues el aire. Ya lo voy a encender. Mamu. Ya te... Ahí está mi hijo y ahí voy a ver a ser el mismo clase a 10 p.m. Ok, terminamos. Me dan un momentito que me venga a estar. All right, everybody finished? Yes. Yes, nice. All right. Let's see. Okay. I'm going to say a name and this person is going to say another name and so on and so on. Okay, so you le pregunto. Por ejemplo, a uh, Yvonne. Yvonne, what time do you wake up? Ella va a dar su respuesta. Y cuando ella haya dado su respuesta, le va a hacer la siguiente pregunta. Cualquiera de estas, ¿ok? A alguien más, pero le va a decir el nombre. Por ejemplo, Yvonne diría, Ramón, what time do you watch TV? No sé, cualquiera de las otras questions. ¿Yes? ¿Estamos ready? Y así hasta que terminemos todas las questions. O hasta que participen todos. Ready? Okay. Either ready Bye. or ready. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Iniciamos con. Let's see. Con Juan Cristóbal. Juan Cristóbal, what time do you wake up? At 6 a.m. after take shower. Okay, I wake up at 6 a.m. and after I take a shower, okay? Usted elige a alguien más y la pregunta que le quiere hacer. Okay. Uh -huh. Yvonne. Okay. Eat breakfast. What time? What time, What time do, do you eat breakfast? Uh -huh. Yvonne. What time do you eat breakfast? At 7 a.m. before I start working. Very good. Continue. Okay, sería um, Briseida. Briseida, mm -hmm. what time do you go to school? <laughs> go to work. <laughs> <laughs> I, I go to work at 7 a.m. while my parents with my family. Uh -huh. Continue, Rita. Dice que aquí no estoy conectado, no puedo ver quiénes están conectados. Alessandra Díaz, aquí está el Ale. Ah, oh, bueno. Oh, bueno. <laughs> eh, Ale. What I do you Hi. cook? <laughs> I <Ma> never, <laughs> I never cook. <laughs> okay, Alessandra, continue. Eh, creer... Brenda. Mm -hmm. eh, what time do you watch TV? Brenda, silence. <risa> Salió. Sí, yo creo que acaba de salir de la sesión. 
Ramón Díaz. Mm. Ay, Ramón, entonces, Ramón, what time do you watch TV? I watch TV after the class. At 10, at midnight, almost. <laughs> okay, continue. Uh, let me see. Douglas Ernesto. Mm -hmm. What time do you go to work? I go to work uh, at at Cayo, Mr. Douglas. Hello, hello. Okay, repeat your answer, Hi. please. Uh -huh. uh, I go to work at around eight o'clock. Uh, I go drive to work uh, usually. I usually drive two hours to go to work. Wow, that's a lot. Continue. Uh -huh. Ahí hay más que nombres de Saudali, César, Andrea, Don Mario. Uh -huh. Déjame, me agarra la corriente. Careful. <ríe> Be careful. Bueno, yo no practico, yo no he participado, pero. I know, 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 I cook. I know, 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 Half an hour. Sí, ya tengo todo en porciones, así que solo... <laughs> So half an hour, 30 minutes is enough. Very efficient. Okay, Esmeralda, tell us. Good night. Hi, good evening. How are you? Bueno, yo acabo de entrar medio, medio he estado oyendo como es. Bueno, yo puedo decir, I go to sleep. Um, 10 p.m. Mm -hmm. Right after the class. Sí. Yes. <laughs> Immediately. Como, sí, como 10, 10. 10, 10. 10, 10, 34, 30. Okay, 10, 30. Mm -hmm. Nice, okay. So... Esmeralda participated, Briseida participated, Juan Cristóbal, Ernesto, Yvonne, Odalis. Odalis, can you speak? Odalis, creo que está just de listo. Hello? Solito me hago la pregunta. Ah, Descríbanos cualquiera de las actividades y a qué hora lo hace. Okay. I what at uh, I six o'clock. At six o'clock, what happened? You wake up. Wake up at six o'clock. Okay, every day. Yeah. All right. No, los domingos no. <laughs> <laughs> and you even that in a weekend too, including the weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Now you say, I no. wake up at six o'clock from Monday to Friday. Yes? Uh, some other. Oh, from Monday to Saturday. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> nice. Okay. Ya todos participaron. Hay alguien que no haya participado. 
Mr. Mario, probably. Ay. Ay. <risa> eh, vamos a agarrarlo a la televisión. Ajá. I never watch TV. Never. You watch videos on YouTube? Excuse me. Do you watch videos on YouTube? Uh, maybe. Maybe. When? What time? Uh, uh, at the morning. In the morning. In the morning. All right. Nice. Okay. Somebody else? Alguien que se nos haya quedado? No? Yo, teacher. Hi, tell me. Uh -huh, Andre. Yo. Tell me, tell uh, me. Okay. I, uh, sometimes I go to sleep at uh, uh, 11 p.m. Okay, sometimes I go to sleep at 11 p.m. All right, perfect. Good job. Good. ¿Hay alguna duda, alguna pregunta o algo que quieran que aclaremos sobre esto? Uh -huh. No? ¿Estamos bien? We're fine? We're okay? Sure? No questions? No, teacher. Okay, nice. Perfect. Bye. Ese es el cuadrito que vimos ayer. Yo les decía que está mejor explicado acá. Porque les dice en qué ocasiones o en qué expresiones de tiempo usar cada una de las propositions, ¿verdad? Dijimos que in lo vamos a usar para... Uh -huh. ¿Para qué? Para estaciones ajá. del año. Sí, Seasons. Ajá. Month and years. Ok. ¿Cuáles son las seasons? Vamos a ver quién se la acuerda. Winter. Spring. Spring. Uh -huh. Summer. Winter. 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 Spring, summer, winter. ¿Cuál es falta? Ajá. Nadie sabe cómo se dice otoño. Spring. Spring. Es primavera. Yes. Fall. Puede ser fall or autumn. Yes. In summer, in winter, in spring, in fall or in autumn. Ajá. Los months. Vamos a ver. César, dígame el nombre de sus compañeros. Give me a name. Briseida. Briseida. Usted la seleccionaron para decir todos los months of the year. Ya me poncharon. Ya me poncharon. No, hombre, Briseida, come on. What happened? Ay, In... ¿Ah? Inténtelo, try. Le ayudamos. Uh -huh. January. 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 February. 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 March. 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 April. 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 May. 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 June. 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 July. 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 August. 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 September. 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 Exactly. Si se fijan, hay muchos que son muy parecidos a español. Yes. Yes. January. Obviously. Desde September. Desde September para allá todos son bien parecidos. Yes. June, July. January, February, February también bien parecido. March, March parecido. April. April, uh -huh. May, 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 June, July, August, September, October, November, December. 
Yes. Bye. Ahora van a escribir yes. en el chat cuando es su cumpleaños, pero no solo digan in December o in January. My birthday is in y dicen el mes. Uh -huh. A ver quién es más rápido de todo. My birthday is in ¿Cómo se escribe birthday teacher? <ríe> no puedo creer. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Is in, ahí está. Exacto. Bueno, no digan la fecha, solo digan el mes. Porque la fecha la vamos a adivinar. Allá, Alessandra y Ernesto va estrellando. Ya hicieron spoiler. ¿no? Ay. Y la sad face. Okay. Porque si dicen la fecha, la preposición no sería in. Tendría que ser on. Exactly. Uh -huh. My birthday is in June. Ahí sí. Uh -huh. My birthday is in... In June, in February, my birthday is in February. My birthday is in January. My birthday is in May. Uh -huh. My birthday is in January. That's great. My birthday is in November. <laughs> my birthday is in August. My birthday is in June. My birthday is in June. My birthday is in March. My birthday is in July. Mm -hmm. Nice. Vaya, ¿qué son todos? Vamos a ver. My birthday is in February. Uh -huh. Vaya. Empezamos. Adivinar. Exactly. <ríe> en el caso de lo que dijeron la fecha exacta, ya no le podemos adivinar, ¿verdad? Porque ya ni modo. It's done. Mario Ernesto, his birthday is on December 8th. Uh -huh. Alessandra, her birthday is on November 26th. All right. Okay, Mr. Batres, his birthday is on June 24th. <laughs> ya estábamos en clase. Sí, ¿verdad? Sí. Y ni le cantamos. Ya no le vamos a cantar a todos los que llevamos aquí acumulados. <laughs> Okay. All right. Bye. Oh, sí. My birthday is in June 20. Oh, okay. Aquí en el caso de que ustedes digan la fecha exacta, la preposición tendría que ser on. On. Yes. Cuando damos fecha exacta, decimos on. Si solo mencionamos el mes, ahí sí decimos in. Sí. Uh -huh. Bye. Douglas, my birthday is in June. Ajá. June 1st. My birthday is in, on June uh, 10th. On June 10th. All right. No, habíamos iniciado aún la clase, ¿verdad? June 10th. Oh, sí. No. 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 Not yet. No. No. All right. Vamos a ver. Mr. Ramón, his birthday is in February. February 14th. No. <laughs> More or less? More. In February 20th. 28. More. <laughs> 29. No. No, no. <laughs> More than 20. More than 20. 21. First. 25. 25. 25. Ah, 25. Alguien ya sabía cuándo es su birthday. No, no. 22nd. 22nd. Yeah. Okay, nice. So his birthday is on February 22nd. Brenda. Brenda, her birthday is in January. January 1st. Brenda. January 1st. No. Vaya, dejemos a Brenda porque no nos está contestando. Juan Cristóbal, his birthday is in January too. January, January 20th. No. More or less. Is five. Ah, on January 5th. Yes. Oh my God, almost New Year. 
Cesar, Cesar, his birthday is in November, all November 15th. Oh, International Men's Day. Oh. <laughs> 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 How am I supposed to do Alguien sabe cuál es el Internacional del Hombre. Solo Cesar. Solo él. No, 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 more. 15. More. 15. 20. No. 21st. No. No. 22. 24 de noviembre. 24th. No, es menos. 19. Menos. 23. Menos. 19. 21. Oh, ya lo veo. 19. 19. On the oh. 19th of November. Yes, 19th. Oh my God. My mom's yes, birthday is on the 15th of November. 19 de noviembre. O ya saben que el Día Internacional del Hombre es el 19 de noviembre. <laughs> my goodness. Okay, Yvonne. <laughs> Her birthday is in August. Yes. The 6th. No. More or less? ¿Cómo? Más o menos. Más o menos. Más o menos. Ah, más. Un poquito La... más. Twelve. Yes. <laughs> so, Yvonne's birthday is on August 12. Nice. Douglas. Douglas, ya le habíamos adivinado. Hello. Sí, ¿verdad? Yes. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yes, so, primero. Odalis. Odalis' birthday is in March. Uh -huh. ¿Alguien que le adivine? 22. On the, on the 8th. No. <laughs> <laughs> On the second. It's five. On the seven. Twenty-one. <laughs> no. Twenty-five. Que diga si más o menos. Uh-huh. Menos than twenty. <laughs> menos than twenty. Ten. Eight. Well, nine, sixteen, twelve, twelve, twelve. On the twelfth of March, very similar. Esmeralda in July. Oh my God! Today. Yes. Really? No. I can start happy birthday, you guys. El jueves pasado fue. Really? Falta un. Ajá, porque si es July. ¿Cómo lo El penúltimo día del mes. The 30. Mm -hmm. The 30 of July. My father's birthday is on the July 30 as well. Oh my goodness. Mister. Um, de Mr. Ramón ya lo habíamos eliminado, ¿verdad? Creo que sí. Ajá. In April, Andrea. Ya. Yeah. Her birthday is in April. Yeah, When, in Andrea? April, April 10th. April. Amor. 20. Eh, amor. Three numbers. Eighteen. Uh, Three numbers más. Eighteen. 
No, eh, 24, 23, 24. 23. Yes. On April 23rd. All right, nice. Yes. All right. So happy Yo no birthday. quise adivinar porque ya sabía. <laughs> <laughs> I am her friend. <laughs> me era soplado, Bri. <laughs> oh, sí. Okay, no me era ayudado. All right. <laughs> So, queda claro, entonces, si vamos a decir la fecha exacta, es acá, ¿verdad? Entonces, on. decimos on, pero si solo mencionamos el month, decimos in. ¿Yes? ¿Y en qué yeah. otras ocasiones podemos usar on? Days and Day. dates. Day. O sea, días o fechas, right? On Monday, on Tuesday, on Wednesday. Ajá, vamos a ver. Mr. Ernesto Batas, diga un nombre. Say a name. Cristóbal. <laughs> Bye, Mr. Cristóbal. Díganos los dates of the week. The days of the week. Está fácil. Mire, me mató este, este señor. Ya vi que... Estaba pensando en otra cosa. No. 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 Bueno, no, prueba ahorita este. Monday. 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 <risa> Vaya. Sí, en los calendarios generalmente, ¿qué, ¿cuál Sunday. es el, el primer día? Sunday. Sunday, ajá. Se va a así como Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Si sí me la voy a aprender. Ya, ya tienen que hacer una canción. Que no me agarre así. Sí, que no me agarre. Echo más ropa este señor. Ya le vamos a hacer una. Right. Sí, gracias. Okay. Sí. Vaya, desquítese, Juan Cristóbal. Diga un name. Ernesto Batre. ¿ves? Sí, Ernesto Batre. Bye, Ernesto Batres. When no. is El Salvador Independence Day? Um, on, 50, on, the, on the 50th of September. On the 15th of September or on September 15th, right? On the 15th of September. <laughs> Sí, de no hay la independencia. 1821. La flor nacional. Ay, Dios. Dios. El isote. Ah, no. No, no le sople. El pájaro nacional. El ave nacional. El sol. El no, ya eso ya se salió de control. Eso ya no lleva prepositions. Vaya, Mr. Patres, otro name. Ya no vaya a elegir a Juan Cristóbal porque ya es tú. No, mi tocayo, Mario Ernesto. Ok, don Mario. When do we commemorate o cuando se conmemora the USA Independence Day? July 4 Oh. On July 4th, exactly. Another name? Mencione alguien más? Um, a quien mencionamos. Quiero ver quién ha participado. Yvonne. Yvonne. Yvonne, tell us the day of Mother's Day. When is Mother's Day? Um, Mother's Day. Mm -hmm. On the 10th. On May 10th, exactly. Okay. All right. Okay. On May 10th. Uh -huh. Or the 10th of May. Cualquiera de las dos formas está correcta, ¿ok? Yvonne, another person? Another partner? Julia Ernesto. 
Douglas, Ernesto. Hi. 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 <laughs> when is Halloween? Halloween is on October 31. October 31st, exactly. Halloween is on October 31st. That's correct. Okay, another name, Douglas. Eh, César. César. A César es una difícil porque ya se sabe hasta el International Men's Day, ok. So. <laughs> <laughs> the opposite. When is the International Women's Day? ¿Ah? Huh? <laughs> Ajá, uh -huh, the International Women's Day is conmemorated. Women's Day. Uh -huh. eh, on... 8th you know, March. Uh -huh, the 8th of March or on March 8th. Correct. That's the exam. Vaya, y lo... Me acordé cuando son las marchas. Lo vamos a sacar de la... Vaya, y la preposición at ya la habíamos practicado, ¿verdad? Que era at y la hora, ¿verdad? At 8 o'clock, ¿ok? Y algunas holidays y estas excepciones de los lapsos del día o de la noche que sería at noon, porque es como a una hora específica, at night y at the weekend, que podría ser on the weekend también, ¿ok? Bueno, será como un repaso. Obviamente estamos haciendo un repaso del de contenido del vocabulario de la Unit 3. Ok. <coughs> Exercise. Organizamos estas preguntas. WH questions. Aquí están en desorden. Ya sabemos cuál es el orden. Primero es WH word. Luego es el auxiliary. Luego es el subject. Bueno. Luego es el verb y luego es el complemento. Entonces, vamos a trabajar en este exercise. Déjenme recrear nuevamente los groups para que trabajen con alguien más. Y quedarían de esta forma, ¿ok? Ahorita les comparto para que puedan resolver. Traten de, si pueden compartir pantalla, igual está bien. Si no, pues lo traten de ir como participando todos los que están en el grupo, de irlas leyendo en voz alta para que vayan pronunciando y vayan quizás quedándoles más claro qué significa cada una de ellas. ¿Ok? Uh -huh. Good night, eh, voy a compartir. Perdón. Voy a compartir, Mario Ernesto. No, yo no puedo. No puede, ¿y usted, Meralda? No, es que yo estoy con computadora. Y el WhatsApp me cae con teléfono. ¿Hola? Es que estoy con la computadora, le digo. Ah, pues ahí le sale mejor. Ajá. ¿Pero cómo lo puedo compartir? Ahí hay un botoncito verde. Donde dice compartir. Pero solo share. la pantalla de nosotros. Good day. Confirm. From com. Confirm. Confirm. No, from. Confirm. No. Confirm. Confirm. Eh. <coughs> Okay. ¿De dónde vienen ellos? Ajá, exacto. ¿De dónde faltó el interrogatorio? ¿Dónde well, vienen ellos? ¿Dónde vienen ellos? ¿Dónde vienen ellos? Ajá. Favorito ya.
Ok. Tu okay, caes la siguiente. What she. What that is. She... No, what, what... that is. What that is. What does she does... do? Uh -huh. What does she do? What does she do? What does she do? What What does she do? Correcto. Right. Okay. Number three. When do you eat breakfast? When do you sí, uh? eat breakfast? Eat breakfast. <laughs> breakfast. Oh. Number four. Um, el signo de interrogación yes. sería sí. what do she does what does she what does she do? She, she do. Pam, 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 pam. Sería, when do you? When do you? Eat breakfast. When do you eat breakfast. Vale. Eh, vamos, why? Why does he? Does he? He? Yeah. He study English. Ruben, he does. Why he, he does. does study English? Mm -hmm. Pero en negro me voy a poner. Así queda. Ajá, así queda. Sería, what, we does he study English? Ajá. Y damos la de respuesta, he study English. At 8 p.m. Ajá. At 8 p.m. Yes, así. Number five. But read do figures how many do? Entonces sería how many do do you home? Así lo puedo escribir. Ma, entonces sería... Where do they Hola, ahí está. No aparece, ¿verdad? Eh, ahí, apare ahí aparece el Word, pero... No sé cómo lo está Hagámoslo así entonces, porque no se puede escribir.
When do they do they play soccer? Okay. Nine. Uh, what? Ahí creo que sería short tail. No, who? Who reads short what tails? Real short tail. Ah, sí. Who reads short tail? Y que eso está algo extraña, ¿verdad? Sí. Está tácito, está tácito el, el, el sujeto. Yes. Who ya es el sujeto. ¿Quién? Ok. Uh -huh. Who reads? ¿Quién? Short stories. Stories. Mm -hmm. uh, when do you celebrate birthday? Your birthday. Ce no, celebrate. Sí. How many? Do you, es en orden de hecho. Mm -hmm. Do you have brothers? Brothers. Solo vas a tirar la compu, salud. <laughs> Tengo mala oh, conexión. Yeah. <laughs> Who often does she? Travel by Europe. ¿Cómo se pronuncia Europe? Europe. Europe. Cuando Dios quiera mandarme. ¿Ah? Cuando vas a viajar por Europa, te, te pregunto si ¿sí, sí. Cuando Dios quiera mandarme por allá. <risa> No, yo ya fui. <risa> Ay, qué modesto, gracias. <risa> Who studies in English? No, yo fui cuando fue la, la jornada mundial de la juventud. Oh. En España. Ahí ando. Conocí al Papa y todo eso. <risa> No, oh, sí me trata. Pues, eh, ¿Cuánto quiere azúcar? How much? How much? much ¿Cuánto quiere de azúcar? Sugar. He wants dos libras. <ríe> want sugar. Teacher. Hi. How much eh, sugar? ¿Cómo se dice dos libras? Two pounds. Two pounds. Two pounds. Two P O U N D S pounds. Two pounds. Mm -hmm. How much teaching. sugar? How much sugar? Tiene que ser la pregunta. How much sugar do you want? Uh -huh. Yes. How much? How much? How much does does he want to add? No. How much sugar does he want? Ah, how much sugar does he mm -hmm. want? Um, how is your house? How is your house? Entonces quedaría, how much does one his sugar? Ajá. My number seven is how your house. Sería how play soccer. When do 
They when do play soccer. They play soccer, sí, correcto. Number nine. Nine sería wo. Wo. Who read? Who read short, short tales? Tales, told, no sé cómo se pronuncia. Short tales, tales, historias cortas. Mm -hmm. Short tales. Who, who read short tales? Yo hoy sale. ¿Eh? ¿Ah? Yo hoy salió. Hoy sí me salió cabalito. Hoy sí va. Sí. Así está bien. Le, le faltó where they do from come. Está mal. Eh, where do you do where es they where... do where they do from come. Sí, así es correcto. Sí. No, sí. es where do they. And ah. where do they? Yes. Ah, sí. Seguimos con la, y vamos con la. ¿Y esa? No, ahí sería What does she do? What does she do? Sí. Yes. Así. Guatas. Sí, sí, correcto. Y continuamos con nosotros. Se la diez y vamos, ¿verdad? Sí. Ahí sería, when do you do, when do, when do you celebrate your birthday? Pikachu. Ellos son como, son este, cuentos, algo así, o leyendas. Okay. Short, short tales. Take care. Short tales. Uh -huh. Como cuentos. Sí, son como así, anécdotas, leyendas, algo así, no sé. Cuentos cortos, dicen que. Cuentos cortos. Ajá. Ajá, cuentos. Ah, ya. Thank you. No sería who read. Who, who read reads short talks. Short, short talks. Number 10. Number 10. Dice, do when celebrate you, you feel it. Sería, when do you? When do you celebrate? Celebrate? Your birthday. Sí, you birthday. Uh -huh. day. Number 11. Does where, she wear read the newspaper? Where? Yeah, where does? Where does she, she read read the newspaper? Newspaper. Así vea. 
Sí. sí read new the new paper. Uh -huh. Natural, how many do you have, brother? How many? How many do, do you have, brother? How many brothers do you have? How many brothers? Did you finish? Yes. No. Yes. Good. No se la escucha, teacher. <laughs> really? Yo sí la escucho bien. Can you hear me now? Sí, yo sí la escucho bien. Oops, some problems probably with the sound. Hello, hello. Sí. Okay, thank you. Oh my goodness. Sí, de hecho me está dando un mensaje. So, dice que my microphone is not working properly. Ya oh. tiene sueño él. ¿eh? El micrófono. Ah, exactly. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> ¿Cómo nos quedó la primera question? Where, Where do they from, do they from, from come? come? Where do they come? From. 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 Where do they come from? ¿A todo esto así? Yes. Yes. Where do they come from? They come from the United States. They come from Europe. They come from Asia. They come from China. They come from Japan, right? Number two. What, what does, does she, do? she do? What does she do? Mm -hmm. She's a lawyer. She's a manager. Yes, she's, she's, a a teacher. she's a teacher, she's a nurse, she's an architect. Remember, what does she do? What does he do? Se refiere a la ocupación de él o de ella. Y si le preguntan a usted directamente, what do you do? También le están preguntando a usted a qué se dedica, qué hace en la vida. Yes? yes. So you say, I'm a nurse, I'm a, I'm a lawyer, I'm a flight attendant. Yes, I'm a supervisor, I'm an engineer. I'm a I'm a shoot maker. That's right. Okay, next. When do you eat breakfast? When do you eat breakfast? Do, do us. Uh -huh. When do you eat breakfast? You say, I eat breakfast at 7, at 8, 7.30, at 6, at 4. Mm -hmm. Next. Why I study English? Why does he? <laughs> Why does he study English? English. Why do you study English? I just study. Study, study. Study, study. He is studying. Study, study. Duplicate. Study, study. Duplicated. At night. He study, study. Yes, sorry. Why does he study English? Mm -hmm. Yes. He studies English because? Mm -hmm. <laughs> because he wants to learn, because he wants to speak with other people, because he needs, yes, at work. How many? Mm -hmm. How many do you? You do, you do. How many what? 
How many books? Exactly. How many books? Do you read books? Do you read books? Or, yeah. yeah. Do you read? Per year. Per year. Mm -hmm. How many books do you read per year? I read four books, I read five books, I read six books per year. ¿Saben cuántos libros deberíamos de leer por el año? Muchos. <laughs> At least 12. Por lo menos uno por mes. Pero we don't read books. Mm -hmm. yeah. One per month. One per month. That should be. All right, next. How much? How much? So one sugar. Sugar. How much sugar? Daddy. <laughs> sugar, daddy. Thus. That's one. How much sugar? How much and how many? Siempre deben llevar el noun después. O sea, ¿cuántos libros? ¿Cuánta azúcar? ¿Qué cantidad de azúcar, verdad? Entonces siempre se necesita el noun. O sea, igual. ¿de qué cantidad de qué se refiere? So, how much sugar does he want? He wants one spoon, one bag, two bags. Yes. Next. How, how is your, your house? house? How's your house? It's big, it's small, it's green. How's your house? It's comfortable? It's white. It's white. Mm -hmm. it's, it's yellow. Fresh. It's fresh. Mal. It's cool. It's, it's beautiful. Modest. It's beautiful. Yes. Next. Green. It's green. Uh huh. When, when, when do, do they play soccer? Play. When do they play soccer? They play on Monday, on Saturday, on Tuesday, on the weekend. Mm -hmm. Next. Who, 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 who real? Who real? Short tail. Short tail. Short tails. Short, short stories, short tales is the same. Who reads? In este caso, el read sí lleva la S porque no necesita un auxiliar who. Who ya es el sujeto de la pregunta, right? Next. When, when, do, you, when do, do you celebrate your birthday? When do you celebrate your birthday? Your birthday. Happy birthday. When do you celebrate your birthday? I never celebrate my birthday. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, next. Where? Where, where does she read the, the newspaper? The newspaper. The newspaper. The newspaper. Do you still read the newspaper? Ya nadie lee el newspaper, verdad? Uh, digital, probably. Digital. Mm -hmm. When does she read the newspaper? In the morning, at noon, at lunchtime. The morning. Mm -hmm. Next. How many? How many brothers? How many? How many? How many brothers? Do you have? Do you, do you have? have? How many brothers do you have? I have three brothers. I, I have brother. five brothers. You don't have brothers. I have six brothers. You have six, I brothers? Have six, six brothers? Really? Five brothers. You have five brothers? Eight. Eight brothers. Brother. Yes. Eight. Eight. A big family. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How often? 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 Does she travel, travel by, by Europe? Europe. By Europe. 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 European. <laughs> European Union. How often does she travel by Europe? Okay, once a month, twice once a year. A year. Mm -hmm. Next. 
who again? Who? Who is studying? Who is studying English? Who is studies English? Who studies English? Everybody. Everybody, <laughs> yes, exactly. And the last one. Where? Where do? do they? Where do you? Or do they? Where they? Where do they? they Today, today, go to school. Go to school in San Salvador. In yeah. Santa Ana, near their house. In the in house. In El Salvador. <laughs> nice. Ooh. Hay alguna question todavía? ¿Cómo estructurar las WH questions? Mm -hmm. Yes. Tell me now. Teacher. Yes. When you say when you says uh, brothers, it's mm -hmm. only brothers, not yes, sisters. Yes, not sisters, just brothers, just men. But I but I hear uh, some people say brothers, but they think it's uh, brothers and sisters. Brothers and sisters. Yes, in este caso serían siblings, son hermanos y hermanas incluidos. O podemos hacer así la eh, perdón la. La combinación. How many brothers and sisters do you have? You have. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How many sisters do you have? For example, if somebody asks me, how many brothers do you have? I have three brothers. But how many sisters do you have? I don't have sisters. I <laughs> had two brothers and two sisters. Ah, and two so four siblings. <laughs> mm -hmm. Es lo mismo con los hijos. Aunque los hijos ya sean adultos, son children. Children. Mm -hmm. child. Child is solo uno. Only one. Uh, only one. The singular. Some, uh, three child. Three children. Three children. Yes. Yeah, so usted tiene tres hijos, aunque ya sean adultos. They said, those are my children. I have three children. No solo se refiere a niños. Y son. Son es hijos. Y si le pregunto, do you have child? Do you have a child? Uno. Tiene un niño o una niña. O sea, un hijo o una hija. Uh -huh. Pero si le quiero preguntar, ¿tienes hijos? Do you have children? Ah, uh, okay. Uh -huh. Any other? No more? No more. Thank no you. No more questions. All right. Perfect. Clear. Clear as the water. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right. Complete the sentence with the correct preposition. I always get up at 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 what? At seven. <laughs> at seven o'clock. At seven o'clock. On Wednesday. On Wednesday. On on weekdays and. Mm -hmm. At, 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 at nine o'clock in, 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 in the weekends, in the weekend, on, on weekends. Recuerden, los días de semana y fines de semana también oh. están compuestos por días, entonces on. All right. Both my little brother and I were born in. In the same in the same month. His birthday is on, on, mm -hmm. on, on, on the tenth of April and I was born on, 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 on the thirtieth, right? Mm -hmm. in, in the moment in the moment. In the moment. Or we at the moment. ¿Qué le suena mm. más normal? In the moment, oh. en el momento, o a este moment. At the moment. At the moment. At the moment. At the moment. Uh -huh. Es como cuando nosotros decimos en español por el momento, right? Estamos practicando prepositions of time. In England, it is often, it often rains. In. 
Spring is spring. In spring. Mm -hmm. My father is a doctor and he sometimes no. works at night. At, at night. At, at night. night. Yeah. Our neighbors move in next door in, oh. in oh. Con los años. With the years in, in 1998. My grandma started learning English uh, in the bed. In the in the in, age of forty. The age of forty. Mm -hmm. Aquí sí metemos que es uh, at, at, at the age of forty, o sea, a la edad de los cuarenta. Okay. Okay. Um, in in, the, in past, the past, people didn't travel so much. James proposed to Linda. Sunset. Sunset. Mm. Yes, sunset. Mm. In the sunset. Mm. In sunset. In sunset. In, in like western sol. Like in the evening. It was very romantic. We mm. usually go rollerblading mm. on, Saturday. On, Saturday. on Saturday morning. Brenda has lunch. At, at noon. At noon. At noon. At noon. At noon. <laughs> and Brenda is at here. Noon. I go to school in the, in the morning. In the morning. In the morning. Uh, and I do my homework. homework. Mm -hmm. I got to be. I do my in, homework in the afternoon. In the afternoon. And I watch TV. At the at at the evening. At the evening. In the evening. In the evening. And I sleep. At night. At night. At night. At night. Oof. Vaya, tome a screenshot ahora. Don't forget. No borró la otra. It's true. Se la borré. Qué mal. Pero esa ya la habían trabajado, así que no problems. Ya, yeah, listo, ready. Ready. All right. Revisemos la attendance, quienes permanecieron en la clase. Andrea. Ya se nos fue, Andrea. Brenda. Briseida. Present teacher. <laughs> Briseida. Still. Present teacher. Hi. Douglas. Present. Ahí está. Aquí está un Ernesto. Yes. Esmeralda. Present teacher. Hi. Estela, no. Ivon, yes. Juan Gustavo, yes. Katia, yes. yes. Marinesto, yes. Mayra, no, verdad. No. Diego Mayra Odalis, yes. Ramón, yes. And Jennifer, no. Dios santo. Ayer Briseida voluntariamente aceptó. Ahora le toca a quien dijimos. A Don Douglas. Ah. A Don Douglas. No, no era. Mío. <risa> ah, no. Ramón, eh. no, no era yo. Don Ramón, eh. Ramón. Ramón. Yes. Dios mi, mi Don Ramón tiene que ir a traer otra vez a su wife. No. Ah, bye. Ya se vino. Not, not yet. <laughs> not yet. Wow, she finishes late. <laughs> yes. My goodness, she's really hard working woman. Okay, the rest. Okay. Goodbye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye. Tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. God bless you. Bye. 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 <coughs> All right, mister. You have any question or something that you need that I explain? Uh, no. Oh, everything, everything right. Okay. Yes. Everything okay. Okay, tell me about today. Today about what? All the activities. Our oh, activities. Yes. Uh, in the morning, I I get up at 5 a.m., mm -hmm. 5 o'clock, mm -hmm. because I have uh, other works. works. Mm -hmm. Different jobs. Yes, I, mm -hmm. I had to go 
at the El Campo. Mm -hmm. say. To the field. To the field. Mm -hmm. and... So you work in the in the countryside. Yes. Nice. What do you do? Plantations? Uh, I... Sembramos corn. Uh -huh. Plant corn. Plant corn. And beans. In San Vicente. In San Vicente, San Esteban, Catarina. Really? Mm. Nice. Pine pineapple. Really? Watermelon. Oh my God, it's near Lempa. No, no. Only in the winter. Only in the winter. Mm -hmm. Incredible. So you have a lot of plantations. Yes. And when you I... and when you harvest the product, do you sell to the market? Yes, it is. Mm, nice. Yeah. Interesting. And then you go to the city hall. Yeah, I go to the city hall and make the some activities there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's my official official work. <laughs> Job. <laughs> the other one is a hobby. <laughs> the hobby. Yes. Nice. But your house is in the city or in the countryside? No, it's in the city. So you go to the countryside every day? Yes. Nice. And do you have another house in the countryside or only the land and the plantation? Only the plantation. And people, do you have people that take care of the plantation? Yes, and mm. in this uh, place I uh, live uh, some people because they had to take care. care they care the, mm. the plantation. Nice. And right now, do you have any products or not yet? Uh, yes, uh, pineapple, piña. Yes, pineapples. In a piña, and in in uh, now only piñas and bananas. Bananas, wow, okay. nice. So you export fruit. <laughs> and no, we sell locally. Um, locally. Interesting, but if we want to go, you can sell. Let's make an excursion to your uh, land and buy pineapples and bananas. Yeah, see. <laughs> it would be nice, right? To have some more of the customers. Uh, and, and, soon, and soon you're going to have corn and beans. Like corn and beer. Mm -hmm. Like in two weeks or three weeks. Mm, like... Uh, a month. Three wheat. Mm -hmm. My father also plants corn. He says, van a ver elotes in three weeks. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh -huh. so we have, sweet we have, corn. Uh, we have tres manzanas. Oh, my God. Uh -huh. yeah. That's early, right? You plant <laughs> very early in May. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. And you sell all the corn when it's uh, fresh, when it's green, or until it's dry? And the fresh. Mm, nice. Because people love to prepare a lot of dishes, it's right? A, it's, a, it's a different... Plantation. Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. I know. Yes, my father explains that to me as well. Yes. Uh, he worked that? Yeah. Okay. He used to plant. And now my brothers. But now just for consuming. <laughs> and we have other other sky to to and we have animals. Ah, oh, cattle. Cows. Mm -hmm. Ganaderia. Cattle. Cattle is como la industria de la, la ganadería. Cattle. Cows is the animal. Because I work by by friend. You live in Boston. Oh, nice. Yeah, only. So you learn English in Boston? Yes. <laughs> I believe. Yeah. And why do you take the classes? And I, I, I take the career uh, because I teach English teacher. 
But really? uh, yes, but uh, it's my it's a problem with me because the university when I was studying and you you are studying and working it's difficult because uh, to focus you don't, on one thing. You don't have, yes, you don't have so so many time to to practice that. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yes, because you have other other priorities. You need to okay. run to work, and you have a lot of responsibilities. It is difficult, I know. In my case, my I, I only studied because I just finished high school and I went straight to university and I studied like full-time student. And then I started working. It's different. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, you had a good uh, vocabulary. <laughs> no, but you too. I mean, your English is way better than the other students. My big problem is uh, I have problem with the pronunciation and uh, some some words uh, and, and do, you, do you ever teach as a as a uh, as a teacher do you ever work as a teacher uh, only in practice and uh, years and a half and you never had a job as a teacher no why I, uh, because uh, now it's difficult to take that work. No, you get it. You can get it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> now, now, este, I am este. How say este? Tomar plaza. To have a, a position, a job position as a teacher. Ministerio de Educación. At the Mined. Mined. Mm -hmm. uh, you tienen, apply. Tienen plaza. I, I apply. Nice. I apply because I had a big opportunity because uh, in my town there are not many professionals they and the school they need a an English, English teacher. teacher let me know if you get it when are they going to to give the positions Como? Cuando les van a otorgar las plazas? No saben. Uh, Ahorita solo ingresando documentos. Mm -hmm. So probably by September. You have to make a... A, a process. A process. Mm -hmm. But probably they, they give the positions in September, October, or by the end of the year. Uh, I think. <laughs> oh, for next year. No. Oh, yes. Yeah, it's a for next year. Yeah, because the process is very but long. I'm, uh, in the, in the school, uh, they had a, a teacher only, they say, uh, está haciendo la, ¿cómo le llaman? La, interinato. Interinato. Internship. Yes, but they, they, they usually start with a new teacher, like the official position at the beginning of the year. And the process sometimes is very long, but you have to be very patient. Uh, Yes, and then we're going to be colleagues. Okay. <laughs> Yay, that's nice. And then we're going to go to San Esteban Catarina to buy your pineapples. Okay. Nice. We, yes, we can get a trip. Yes, it, it's a wonderful. Interesting town. Yeah, interesting. Yes, a picturesque town. We have, we have many projects. Nice. That's good. We need to have these projects in towns. I went to La Libertad on Saturday, but we went to Ocotepec, I think that's the name. I don't know, I don't know, only listening. Mm -hmm. And then on Sunday, I went to my town, Ilovasco. Ilovasco. Yes. It's, it's beautiful, yes. And we have a, a road that connects Ilovasco with San Sebastián. Well, not Ilovasco specific. It's near San Rafael Cedros. And we are we are between um, San Sebastián and San Lorenzo. In San Lorenzo. And Santa true. Clara. It's Santa Clara. Santa Clara is beautiful. Sí. They have a lagoon. <laughs> A Pastepeque. <laughs> Se pelean, que dicen que a Pastepeque sí. que es de Santa Clara. Los de Santa Clara dicen que no pertenece, los de Pastepeque que también. I know, no, sí. I know the story. <laughs> sí, <okay. laughs> I have a friend, I used to have a friend that, I mean, 
She's supposed to live in Santa Clara. She had a restaurant near the lagoon. In El Faro, no. Don't remember oh, the name. <laughs> restaurant. Uh huh. A long time ago. Around there. Mm -hmm. There are many restaurants, I know. All right. Well, mister, it's been a pleasure. Okay, say to me. Okay. Take care. Have a good night. Okay. Have a good night. Okay, see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye.